Hey everybody, so today I'm going to do a kind of like a book review. Um, tons of people do these. Um, I don't know, all about Glitter's 21 Calls and Flutters, and I can't really think of anyone else off the top of my head, but um, there's like tons of videos like these, and these are actually some beauty books that I picked up, and I they're like really interesting to read, especially if you're someone that really doesn't love to read. I actually personally love to read. Um, not that I really have time in college because I... Um, I always have to read my textbooks, which is definitely not very interesting, but, um, so yeah, they, um, you can get them at, like, let me think, where did I get mine? I got one at Barnes & Noble, and then I actually got one at American Eagle, which is kind of, like, really random, and it was actually 50% off because it was sidewalk sales in my mall, and I don't know if you guys have those, but it's actually, like, not on a sidewalk, it's, like, inside the mall, and, um, all the stores just put, like, all these, like, really cheap things, like, outside the store, so you shop kind of, like, how to explain it, like in the aisles, not in the aisles, in like the walkway of the mall, that doesn't really make any sense, but like then there's still stuff obviously in the store, but like the really cheap stuff is outside the stores, um, but yeah, so this was actually 50% off at American Eagle, and it's called the InStyle Ultimate Beauty Secrets, and then I actually like this one the best, um, it was $22.95, but I got it half off, and then it's just like all these like little like tricks, like beauty tricks, and they're like really short, and then there's, like, different chapters, like, um, I'll tell you what, like, the different little chapters are. It says, skin, foundation and concealer, cheeks, eyes, lips, nails, and the best of the rest. And, um, it also, there's also, like, famous people, like, not famous people, but, like, like, makeup artist opinions and stuff in here, like, Bobby Brown, and, and then there's, like, some, here, like, here we go. There's some, I guess there are, like, famous people, like, what they think, like, their tips are and everything. Um, but yeah, it's just like something kind of interesting to read and I've kind of like tried out some of the tips and I really like them. Um, but yeah, like, like I said, if you're not really into reading, these might, this might be something that's kind of like interesting to you if you like makeup, obviously. If you don't, well, sorry, I guess it's not very interesting then. But, and then this is the Lauren Conrad style book. Um, I'm not like huge into fashion, which is like kind of like bad, I know, but I mean like I obviously like like to look cute and stuff, but I mean I don't always have like perfect outfits and stuff. Sometimes I just kind of like throw stuff on and go. Like today, I have this big like fluffy vest on because it's like uh, negative 18 degrees outside Fahrenheit, which is like freezing, which is like how many degrees, degrees below freezing? 50 degrees below freezing. So yeah, that's like really cold. Um, but she has got like, anyways, back to what I was talking about. She, so there's a lot of stuff on like fashion in here, like you know, that's kind of interesting, you know, not, like, totally my thing, but, um, then there's, like, this whole chapter on, like, makeup and, like, nail polish and, you know, there's actually kind of, like, a lot of different things in here, but, um, I thought this was kind of interesting to read, too, like I said, um, I really liked the part about makeup, I don't know, there's kind of just cute pictures, this book was $20 and I did pay full price for this one, um, there's actually a book by, um, Bobby Brown it's like it's actually kind of expensive it's like $25 but it's like really thick and it's like all Bobby Brown's like little tricks and tips and then there's one by um Carmen D from what not to wear I really like her um that I think I'm gonna check out too so yeah and then this is random I'm totally just looking at this right now but like I bought play-doh last night because one of my classes whoops, I'm taking is um this is econ class and it is so boring and you don't have to take notes in it because she like gives you all the notes so you just have to, like, sit there, but it's, like, there's only about 150 people in that class, so you can't, like, not pay attention because it's, like, too small of a class to, like, not pay attention. So it's, and she talks, like, really monotone. It's really bad. I hate econ, and I don't know why I have to take it for dietetics, but, see, look, Play-Doh. I always love the smell of Play-Doh. Is that weird? Sorry, I just dropped the lid. Yeah, that's probably kind of weird. It smells kind of salty, but, um... <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, I got like all these cool different colored Play-Dohs, and it only costs like $3. I have two girls, whoa, that I sit with in Econ, and maybe I'll give them one to play with too, because, like I said, it gets really boring. But I'm going to go, so I hope everyone has an awesome day, and thanks for watching. Bye.